Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. It's your girl, Bliss Curls. Please take a moment to like, share, and subscribe. If you're new here, hit that notification bell so you can stay up to date with what I'm doing. This video right here is a wash and go versus twist out comparison video using Mayel Organics Twisting Souffle and Curl Smoothie. Just wanted to show y'all the difference between the two and, you know, how the products worked. So let's get into it. So for this twist out guys, we're going to start on freshly washed hair. My hair was washed and conditioned. Um, and next we're going to go in with our Myel Organics Pomegranate and Honey Leave-In Conditioner. I'm just going to pump a little bit of that into my hands. And I'm going to be begin to work that product through until my hair is fully saturated with the product. Once I get my leave-in in there real good and my hair is fully saturated with the leave-in, I'm going to section my hair off and begin to put in the twisting souffle. So I'm just going to take a little bit of that into my fingers, not very much, and I'm just going to smooth that onto a section of hair and begin to two-strand twist. Depending on what size twist you like, you can make the twist bigger or smaller. Um, it just all depends on your preference. Mines are kind of small, but I'm going to end up separating them and fluffing them out anyway. So. Once my hair is all twisted, I'm going to prepare for bed and put on a silk bonnet. The bonnet will protect your twists and just keep them looking nice and shiny and smooth and fresh throughout the night. So it's the next day and as you can see, I do have a little bit of shrinkage, but it's okay. Um, I'm going to go in with this Myel Organics Rosemary and Mint Oil. I'm going to rub a little bit of that into the palms of my hands and on my fingers so that when I take down my twist, um, the oil will help to reduce frizz and also give me a little extra shine as well. So as you can see here, I have great definition and I'm really loving the results so far.
after I've separated my twist once, I'm going to go in and just begin to separate them again. Just kind of feeling where the hair separates naturally um, to prevent frizzing. And I'm just going to um, separate them to give myself a little bit more volume. Now I'm going to go in with my pick. As many of you all know, I love my big hair. So I'm just going to begin to pick from my roots out just to give myself even more volume because I love big hair, big hair, don't care all day. And yeah, with twist outs, you really just have to learn how to manipulate them, separate them, um, fluff them into the shape you want so just continue to play around with it until you get the look that you're really looking for Here we are folks, a defined, shiny, beautiful twist out using my Yale Organics Twisting Souffle. I do love the results. I'll probably pick it some more off camera just because I want it much bigger than this. But yeah, I love the results. Tune in next for the My Yale Organics Curl Smoothie Wash and Go tutorial. Hey y'all for this wash and go, sorry I got something in my eye. So we're starting with freshly washed hair for this wash and go. Um, it was actually washed and deep conditioned and steamed. As you can see my new steamer back there. Um, freshly washed hair, it feels good. We're gonna go in with the Maya Organics Pomegranate and Honey Leave-In Conditioner. We're gonna do just like we did for the twist out, pump a little bit into our hands and begin to work the product through with our fingers from root to ends until the product is fully saturated onto our hair. Once the leave-in is in, we're gonna go in with the curl smoothie. And we're just going to do the same exact thing. We're going to pump it into our hands and begin to rake the product through with our fingers from the roots into the ends until the product is fully saturated and our curls are popping like so, like that. For a little razzle dazzle, sometimes I like to twirl the ends of my hair just to give it a little more curl um, for my wash and goes. So that's what you see me doing here. Now 
Now typically one would probably diffuse um, their hair after this and then go wherever they going, but I'm about to go to bed. So I'm taking my silk scarf, I'm pineappling my hair, and I'm preparing to go to bed like my little girl right there, if you can see her arm. <laughs> So, um, yeah, I'm just pineappling my hair just to help protect the curls and preserve them for tomorrow. Next day, we're going to take off this silk scarf and see how popping our curls are as you can see my hair still looks good it's a little smushed but nothing a good pick won't help um, so we're just going to begin to fluff out with our fingers and shape the hair how you want it i like to give myself a little fake bang in the front um, and i'm going to go in with my pick and just begin to pick my hair out to the shape and the volume that i like And here we have it folks, a super fluffy, super light wash and go. My curls are defined, my hair is big, and I'm loving it. Um, I'm not, I don't know which one I like more. Here lately, wash and goes have been my go-to. Twist outs, I haven't been doing too much, but you know, I kinda, I'm feeling both of them. Leave me a comment down below which, which one you like better and what's your go-to style. Do you prefer wash and goes over twist outs or vice versa? Let me know. Thank y'all so much for tuning in once again. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And y'all be blessed and be safe.